see uh, 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 we had um, opportunity in, uh, to be fraud. To be fraud, yes, fraud, right? Yes. F R A U D. What does that mean? We could become the victim of fraud. Uh, aha. Hmm. Uh, Penipuan. Yeah, fraud tu dia ada nama lain dia. Nama lain dia apa? Uh, scammer. Okay. Yes, yes, yeah, scam. Correct, kan? Like we have a lot of scammers these days, and many of them can be found through online shopping. Yep, good. Okay, yeah. next one. What about social media? Again, everything around us, there are advantages, there are disadvantages. So can I ask, who have I not asked today? Faiz, what are the two advantages of social media? Uh, two advantages of social media is, first, we can get a lot of news mm -hmm. from social media. Mm -hmm. And second, I think it is easy to connect thing, connected with other people. Easy to connect, yes, correct. Okay, that's probably one of the best advantages, one of the pri primary advantages of social media. You can connect with anyone easily. Good, but also there yes, are yes. disadvantages, kan? What are the disadvantages of social media, Shahira? Uh, with Shahira, Shahira with an E. There's one with an E, there's one without an E, can Eja add? Betul tak? Ah, uh, um, uh, these are with an E. With E, oh, okay. Oh, you're not. <laughs> Shahira with an E, where are you? Shahira with an E, ada tak? Okay, tak ada dan without E. Shahira without E. Uh, uh, lack of emotional, <laughs> uh, lack of emotional connection. Oh, that's First, a good one, Jira. Yes, yes. And second, um, maybe give people uh, a license to be heartful. To be, what do you mean, heartful? Um, uh, means um. Um, uh, uh, like netizen, is it? Do you mean like netizen? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ne ah. netizen. Ah, uh, salah faham macam tu lah, miscommunication. Or... Yes, correct. Uh -huh. Easy, you know, you can get miscommunication uh -huh. easily through social media because people don't explain themselves fully, kan? Ah, uh, yes. Okay, right. Good, good. So, just, you know, these are again, just sort of like brainstorming or ice breaking for you to get into the mood of advantages and disadvantages. Now we're going to look at, um, what do you call it? Uh, a video after this. Still again, the idea today is to let you know to use the right expressions when pitching ideas at work. Okay, let's get up here. Let's go to the next slide. I don't know why my slide is not moving. Uh, okay, wait. All right, so we're going to watch a video, everybody. Please let me know if you cannot hear the sound. Just, I'm going to explain the video a little bit. What's going to happen in the video is that you will see two colleagues or office mates. They are both talking about or pitching ideas about how to make their office environment better. So in this video, you will listen to a few phrases talking about advantages and a few phrases talking about disadvantages. So I would like you to just listen carefully and try if you can jot down what are the phrases showing advantages what are the phrases showing disadvantages? Or possibly what are the phrases showing that um, they are doing comparison of the idea? Okay, so I'm going to play the video. Tell me if you can hear the sound. This is from British Council, yeah, by the way. Okay.
picture. I'm just going to fast forward. Do you hear the sound, people? Yes. Okay, yes, good. Me. Do you know what to say when you discuss advanced? when you discuss advantages and disadvantages? Listen out for useful language for discussing advantages and disadvantages. Then, we'll practice saying the new phrases. After this. So, table tennis, uh, bean bags, board games, video games. Hey, how about a trampoline? Stop right there. I love your ideas, Noelia, but a trampoline? Really? Absolutely. When do you have your best ideas? I don't know. Um, usually when I'm cooking, I suppose. Exactly. We often have our best ideas when we are away from our desks. The other day, I was on a trampoline and the vision for the creativity room came to me. Why were you on the Trump? Never mind. Look, on the one hand, it's a lovely idea and it fits with our brand. But on the other hand, it could be noisy and chaotic and maybe too much fun. But having fun helps you be creative. And being creative is vital to our business. I see what you mean, but I'm just not sure if a trampoline is necessary. Also, there could be an issue with the clients arriving at the office and seeing us all jumping around. I see where you're coming from, but I think our clients will love it. And there are lots of advantages to trampolining. It's good for the body and the mind. Maybe, but I can also see the disadvantages. What if someone hurts themselves? But we're all adults. And we can get extra insurance. Come on, it's a great idea. Okay, I'll think about it. Perfect. I'll email you some links. I haven't said yes! Oh, Amelia. Hello again. Okay, so did you hear the conversation? Yes. Hello again. Yes, did you? Yes, okay. Let's just discuss briefly what were they talking about just to see that we are on the same page. What were Noelia, one person is called Noelia and Yuna, the other one, what were they talking about? About to... Advantage and disadvantage trampoline. Mm, okay, so basically Noelia suggested that they uh, bring trampoline into the office, right? Yes. Yes. Um, and was Yuna up to the idea? Does she, did she like the idea? No. 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 What, no. Was, what were some of the reasons that she gave the, the idea? Too yeah, much fun. Too much fun. Too much fun, yeah. What no, else did she say? Noisy and chaotic. No, chaotic. Chaotic. Yeah. Issue, issue with the client. Issue with the client. Can, so get, hurt. can get hurt. Someone can yeah, get someone, hurt. Yeah. Someone. Someone, someone, someone said something. Someone will get hurt. Oh, yeah. yeah, someone will get hurt. Correct, correct, right. So why, why was it that they wanted to bring trampoline into the office? It's good for body and mind. It's good for body and mind. Yeah. For fun, for body and mind. Fun. Really stress. stress. For yeah. having fun. To have fun. Yeah, the idea initially was to bring... Lie with the company. To, sorry? Lie to with the company. Lie with the company? Uh, concept of the company. Oh, okay, yes. Align with the company, yeah, because uh, the company wants to bring some sort of um, extra fun for the for the workers, kind. So that's why they were discussing and Noelia came out with the trampoline idea. Okay, I won't play. Um, okay, wait, there's a cat probably fighting somewhere. Never mind. Okay. So let's look at the next slide. Okay. Did you notice anything about the accents of the two people? 
Yes. Yes. But yes. What about them? Yang baju merah tu French. French. Oh, They're how do you know? <laughs> how did you know, Cairo? The the woman that wear the suit in red uh -huh. is like the, her accent is like an European. Uh huh. Uh huh. Correct. Yep. I don't know if she's French or if she's Spanish. I'm not sure about that. But yep, you are right because in um in what do you call it? In Britain, there it is a melting pot. You've got a lot of people coming over to work and to live there. So here uh, on British Council, if you go to their website and you watch their videos, all the speakers are not native speakers of English, meaning they don't use English as a second as a first language. So Yuna, if you can tell, um, she's Asian and I think she's, if not Korean, Japanese. And Noelia, yep, you're right. She is probably French or Spanish, either way from the European, one of the European countries. So you can hear from the accent, yeah? That is not British accent. That is someone who doesn't speak English as a first language accent. Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay. Let's just play and check our understanding. True or false? Number one, can I have Anis reading it? Anis, you can see, girl? Yes. Okay. Noria thinks it would be a good idea to have a trampoline in the office. Mm -hmm. Is it true or false? True. True, correct. All right. Number two, Aza, can you read number two? Yuna has her best idea when she's at her desk. Mm -hmm. um, yes. Yes. Is it? Yeah, yeah, Yuna. Yuna, Yuna is the, the, the Asian, right? Ah, the Asian. The Asian lady. Ah, oh, no, no. No, no, no. It's no. wrong. Well, when? Ah, when? Yeah, because when? She, she, she said that uh, she will get the idea during the cooking. Yes, exactly. Yes, ah. correct. She said she's got her best ideas when she's cooking, then. Yep. But okay, good. All right, number three. Uh, can I listen to uh, Zakia? Number three. Zakia, are you in? Or you've been out? Can oh, I okay. This? You're calling my name. Yeah, Sorry. Zakia. <laughs> <laughs> the sound oh is God. also problematic. Your connection is <laughs> Oh, sorry. Uh, sorry. Uh, apa ni? Uh, Nolia has never been on a trampoline. Ah, betul. So true uh, or false? True, I think. True, yes, because she was jumping on a trampoline. That's how she got the idea. Correct. Ah. Okay, number four. Let's listen to. Uh, hey, can I try? Siapa tu? Who? Faiz. Faiz. Okay, Faiz. Sure. Uh, number four, right? Yes, number four. Uh, you know, it's worried about what the clients would think of the trampoline. The answer mm. is yes. Yes, yeah. She's worried that the client might come in and see all the employees jumping on the trampoline, right? Yes. Okay, good. And last but not least, number five. Can I listen to Salisa? Mm. Oh, Kaz. Afterwards, I'll let Kaz answer, okay? Salisa, are you around? Ah, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Yuna says yes to uh, Nolia's idea. So, uh, no. No. She said she has not agreed yet, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay, good job. Right. So, now we are going to get... Okay, sorry. Uh, this is These are some of the words or phrases that you can use when you are writing or talking about advantages and disadvantages. So, I'm going to let you read through very quickly for one minute. Then we're going to answer number one until number eight, okay? Just quickly breathe through. Okay, done, everybody? Yes. Okay, Kaz, can you do number one, Kaz? Yes, teacher. Okay, can you read? On the one 
Ah, okay. Yeah. I want to see the face. Tadi tak mau keluar. Okay. Now can you see? Face je. Uh, on the one. Number one and number two, they are related, yeah? Number one yes. and number two. Okay, on the one, uh, advantage is a lovely idea, right? This one. Mm -mm. On the one, I'm giving you a clue here. I'm giving you the clue with this gesture. The one coming. No. <laughs> what did you? Yeah. On the one that your brother is giving you clue as well, not giving you clue, giving you answers. Uh. On the one. Wait, it. Yeah. On the one. What did you wait? Huh. <laughs> I can't get it. I don't get it. You don't get it? Okay. Yes. So when you're comparing something, kan, hmm? you nak kata dia ada advantage, dia pun ada disadvantage. So here you would say on the one hand. hand. Yes. Hand. Right, okay. So you would say on the one hand is a lovely idea. But on the... Apa? Yeah. On the other. On the other. Good. Okay. So, ni when there is one idea, you're comparing them straight away. So, on the one hand, it's a lovely idea, but on the other hand, it could be it could noisy. Be noisy. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, that's the trampoline. Okay. Right. What about number three? Uh, can I listen to Haja? Haja, you around? Oops, oops. Haja, are you here? Number three. Haja. Oh, Haja. Can Haja listen to me or not? Haja can hear me ke tak tu? No? Cairo, what about you? Cairo, what do you think about number three? I see what you issues. I see what you issue, no? What you say? Mean. Ah, yes, I mean. Yes, I see mean. what you mean. The Bali translation is just say faham apa maksud awak? Ha, apa awak maksudkan? So the English version is I see what you mean. Right? Okay, number 4. I'm just not uh, sure. Sure. sure, yes, I'm just sure. not sure if a trampoline is necessary, correct? Right? And then number five, there could be an... When you want to see there, there could be a problem. Issue. Issue, issue. yes. Issue. An issue with the client seeing us jumping around. Right. So number six, I see where you're... Coming from. Coming, coming from. 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 Uh, Ini pun maksud dia sama macam number three. I see what you mean. I see where you're coming from. Macam saya faham maksud awak. But, ah, dia macam tu. Okay, so you can say I see what you mean or I see where you're coming from. But usually when you want to disagree or you want to say the disadvantage, these are the two phrases that you can use without sounding rude. Okay. All right, number seven, there are lots of Advantages. 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 It's good for you. And then here, I can also see the disadvantages. Advantages. Disadvantages. What if it hurts someone? Yep. And these are more, what do you call it? More uh, phrases and useful expressions you can use when you are describing the pros and the cons. So pros and cons are what, people? Pros means? Positive. Positive. Cons? Negative. Cons. Negative. Negative. Yes, correct. Okay. So, for the advantages, you can say uh, another benefit is, or trampoline is beneficial. You can say another strong point is, um, and you say trampoline is the X factor that would boost our sale, for example. And then you can say creativity is a selling point for us to get a trampoline. And then you can also say trampoline is in favor of a healthy working environment. So these are more professional ways 
of saying advantages. What about the cons, the disadvantages? You can say one of the shortcomings, one of the setbacks, one of the drawbacks, one of the downside, and one of the limitations. So all these are phrases and expressions to say advantages and disadvantages. Okay, any questions so far before we get to the talking part? Anything you would like to clarify? Or you would like to no. ask so far? No? Yeah. Okay. No. Now yeah. let's go to... Yeah, ada siapa-siapa nak tanya? Yes, Kaz Winnie. Yes, Kaz. Uh, what the meaning of limitation? Limitation. Limitation means, um, you know, limit. from the word limit, kan? Uh, limit to something yang melimitkan you. Limit. Okay. Yeah, so limitation is another way of saying disadvantage. Advantage. So you can say one of the limitations of trampoline is we might seem childish. Contoh. Okay. Okay. Contohnya. All right. Good job. Yeah. Okay. We're going to. Ha. Okay. Job. Not yet. Not yet here. Going to the next page two. Right. So this is what you'll be doing today, everybody. You're going to be pitching your idea as well in groups in breakout rooms but before that let's have a read um can i listen to who would i like to listen to uh who would like to volunteer to read this me okay anis go ahead a study in malaysia showed that 70 percent of respondents reported increased level at anxiety during the early phase of the covid 19 outbreak Mm -hmm. Yet, mental health remains a topic that is fully understood. Mm -hmm. For many people, this remains a hard topic to talk about. Mm -hmm. Mental health at the workplace is a rising concern that should be addressed by responsible employer. Mm -hmm. in, in group of three, you are going to discuss how a company can improve the mental state of each worker through an innovative innovation. Mm -hmm. Your innovation should highlight the advantage as well as acknowledge the disadvantages that the innovation may pose. Okay, right. So any questions about your next task, Me, Do you have anything that you would like to clarify? So do you understand what is required from you? So the objective is you're coming out with an innovation, kan? What is the objective of your innovation? Uh, to reduce the level of anxiety. Yes, to reduce the level of anxiety, the level of, uh, what do you call it? Mental health issues to help overcome with mental health issues because uh, due to COVID-19, since the COVID-19 outbreak in Malaysia itself, there is an increase of mental health issues at the workplace, in school, everywhere. So being a good company, you want to come up with something so so as to help to as to help your workers overcome or ease themselves in these trying times jadi what do you understand by the word and innovation come with, come and uh, come with the idea mm -hmm, yes meaning it doesn't have to mean you can innovate something totally new take the conversation mm -hmm. between uh, Noelia and Yuna, for example. Noelia just wanted to bring in a trampoline. A trampoline is not a new innovation. It's been along for the longest time. But having a trampoline in the company, that is an innovation. That is a new idea. It's something new and creative. So that is what we meant by having an innovation to help overcome mental health issues at the workplace. Okay? So... After this, in groups of three, for about just five minutes, you'll be talking about what would you bring, what would you innovate in your company to help ease mental health problems amongst the workers. Okay, so you just come up with one innovation and talk about the advantages and disadvantages of your innovation. But since you are proposing um, the idea, can of course, make sure that the, there are more advantages than disadvantages. So that because, you know, uh, for next week, this week we're learning about innovation. 
Next week, we are going to learn about how to write feedback or review or how to give feedback and review. And we are going to base on all your innovations for this week. Okay, so just one innovation, but that innovation, you must address both advantages and disadvantages. Bolega? Anything innovation to reduce anxiety, right? Yeah, anything, like be creative. To reduce anxiety. To reduce anxiety and mental health. Mental issue. health. Mm -mm. It could okay. be anxiety, it could be depression, it could be just, just feeling overwhelmed or stressed okay. out. Stress, feeling overstressed one is actually a mental health issue. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. Okay. So anything interesting? All right. Five minutes, you go again. Yes, we need to talk advantages and disadvantages at the same time, is it? Yeah, yeah. But because, again, you're trying to sell your innovation, can Pay more attention to the advantages. Okay. And when you are speaking later, because you'll be presenting your idea, I'm going to the previous slide later. I want you to use the phrases that we've looked at, either from the conversation between Noelia and Yuna, or the, the other pros and cons from the previous slide. Try not to repeat the same phrases or among the three of you, jangan tiga-tiga say the same thing. The next disadvantage is, the next advantage is tak mau. Uh, add variety to your conversation, to your proposal. Okay? Boleh ke? Okay, so we're okay. going to have about five minutes of discussion. And then after that five minutes, we're going to come back to the main room. And what's going to happen is, uh, based on your group mates, based on the group you'll be assigned to later, all of you will be presenting your idea. So maybe you can discuss siap siap uh, siapa nak cakap apa, siapa nak cakap apa. And in that group, you will have three minutes. So three of you, three minutes, about one minute each, talking about your innovation and how your innovation will help uh, reduce mental health issues at the workplace. Okay, good. Okay, teacher. Okay, so I'm going to put um randomly you guys into a group. But I hope they don't put Faiz and Kas together. Because last week, Zoom put Faiz and Kas together. Okay, breakout rooms. There are 12 participants. So let me have four. Four breakout rooms, okay? Right, assign automatically. We'll see what happens. Uh, the rooms with only two people, or should I just have three rooms? Okay, three rooms saja lah. Okay. Uh, teacher, it means that yeah. one group, one innovation, or one person, one innovation? One group, one innovation. One group, one innovation. Okay. One saja. Uh, uh, miss, you are yeah. lack of connection. Okay, can you repeat again? Okay, okay wait, wait, wait. Sekejap, ya, tak dengar. Okay, can you hear me now? Yeah. Uh, yes. Okay. Yes, yes. So, one group, one room, one innovation only. That's why you need to discuss. Okay. okay. So yeah, one, yeah, one room, one innovation. But that innovation, you will talk about advantages more, but you will also acknowledge the disadvantages. Remember, your your objective is to reduce mental health at the workplace. So you can explain. Macam mana you punya innovation ni akan tolong. Okay, now I'm going to do the group again. Five minutes, remember of preparation time. Okay, so we've got the room. There will be four in a group. Uh, only one room with three people, yeah? But that's okay. So all the best, five minutes. Anis, you can move to room one, Anis. You can accept to join. Haja. 
Okay, assign to Aja, we'll go to room three. Okay. Hi everybody, welcome back. Hi teacher. Hi, Did you teacher. manage to discuss your innovation? Uh, yes. 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 Okay. That's great. So are we ready to present? Yes. 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 Okay. So what's going to happen is um, I'm going to, you can see my slide kan? Nampak tak? Yes. Mm -mm. yes. Okay. So I'm going to go to the next slide and tell you what we are going to do with the words on the next slide. Okay, here, uh, do you notice that when we Malaysians uh, are talking, we always use the same vocab or the same word. We always say, I want to say that, I want to mention that, I would also like to say that. It's always say or mention, say or mention, betul tak? Yes. Okay, so this is another way of, Sorry? What is it, Zakia? Anyone say something just now? Uh, I say it. Itu dia yang saya tahu. Sorry? Itu dia yang saya tahu. I say that. <laughs> ah, I itulah. Say <laughs> only word that they are, the only word that like um, vocabulary, I think. <laughs> when you're presenting, you always say, uh, even the bosses at the higher higher level, they're always using only this. But, you see, there are actually a lot other ways that you can substitute say and mention with. So, for example, number one, yeah? I would like to highlight that showing you nak menekankan ni yang paling penting ni. You can say I would like to highlight that trampoline could help reduce mental health issues for example. You can also say I would like to emphasize that. Again, same concept. You nak menekankan. In DM is like menekankan lah kan. 
And then you can also say, I cannot stress how important this is, for example. I would like to stress that. I cannot stress how important this is. So that's another way of using stress. Stress pun maksudnya menekankan. Ah, stress tu macam... <laughs> Uh, macam pressure. Uh, <laughs> macam pressure. Press. Yes, <laughs> pressure. In this case, kan, macam you nak cakap, ni sangat penting. So that's why I want to stress. You can say, I I cannot stop stressing how important mental health is, for example. Okay. And then number four. Number four, five, six are the longer phrases that you can use. You can say, I would like to address, to address the importance of something. So for example, uh, Azza, what's your innovation, Azza? Can I surprise? Okay. Uh, 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 innovation. Uh, uh, ini dah, uh, now we have to start or just giving the innovation? No, you're just giving example. Oh, okay. The, the, our, our group is we want to do the online Zumba and run competition. Mm, okay, so if you are saying that you can say, I would like to address the importance of keeping yourself fit kan that is why online zumba is so important to help reduce mental health at the workplace so that's one way of you saying it you can also say that okay macam tu you you fikir apa what do you call it apa advantage of online zumba so you masukkan dekat sini okay same goes number 5 i would like to acknowledge that we should always keep ourselves healthy so that we are not easily stressed. So you can also say, I would like to acknowledge that. And finally, you can say, I would like to draw your attention to the fact that... So some of the ways, instead of just saying, I want to mention, I want to say... Huh? Some of the ways you can use when you are presenting after this. Okay? Okay. All right, ready? Yes. Yes. Okay, can I start with room one first? I tak ingat siapa dah room one tadi. Do you remember your, your room numbers? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, so who's in room one? Who is number one? No, who's number one? <laughs> who's in room one tadi ni? Uh, Zakia, Salisa and Anis. Ah, okay. <laughs> Zakia, Salisa and Anis. You guys have got three minutes tau. Uh, uh, Anis, you talk. <laughs> <laughs> me? <laughs> Let me just get to. I want to see the faces of people talking. Nampak tak? Okay, who is going to start? Anis, yeah? Yes. Okay, Anis, you can start. Ready? Uh, yes. Okay. Yeah. All right, one, two, and start. Okay, uh, an innovation that uh, my group things to uh, reduce the mental health is doing a campaign. Mm -hmm. uh, this because uh, doing campaign and talk about uh, the feeling uh, and we can say about uh, ice breaking. So uh, why we why we why we uh, think about this innovation is because uh, when uh, Employee talk. Uh, employee talk. Um, talk about their feeling. Employee talk about their problems to the company. Uh, this can uh stay in a uh, good mental and uh release their stress uh during work. And on the other hand, also can make the relationship between the company and employee become more closer. So, uh. Dia seorang je cakap je semua cakap eh. In three minutes semua. Three minutes everyone has to speak in uh, in three minutes ni. Eh. So Anis can pass to the next person. Yeah I pass to the next I think uh, Sarina can can add more what I want. Okay alright. Salisa next. Salisa. Okay. Uh, I would like to uh, stress that uh, mm -hmm. The campaign also can uh, increase the, um, the relationship between the staff and the company mm -hmm. because of the staff can uh, talk about their, their feelings, their problem. Uh, maybe uh, sometimes uh, they have a problem with the 
uh, money also because of uh, because of the COVID-19, uh, many of company was start to cut their salary and then uh, when when the, when the staff start burden with that problem, so I think HR is the best uh, place to them to uh, try to release your problem. So maybe that company can uh, also provide provide the 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 means uh, loan to their staff. Okay, all right. And then uh, the others the others words also um, can um, increase the staff motivation. Uh, to do to do the work lah because of uh, all their problems uh, because they re they realize they release realize re realize that realize that uh, company uh, uh, take care with the with the with the workers so uh, they become uh, works more to to um, means uh, give the full they are they are responsible to the company lah. Okay, I pass to the next person. Thank you. Okay, who's okay, the next uh, one? Zakia. Uh, Zakia, can you speak in less than one minute, Ken? Oh, sure. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, so uh, by having this campaign, uh, we are going to have uh, disadvantages also. So the main disadvantages is on the cost itself because mm -hmm. by having a, a campaign, we need uh, company need to fork out their money uh, for this kind of campaign to do uh, maybe uh, they can Hire. invite uh, a doctors uh, to uh, to join the campaign uh, to give uh, some uh, feedback or uh, ideas on how to reduce uh, their mental illness uh, so uh, that's the main thing uh, just one minute miss okay, okay. Uh, that's all thank all right. you <laughs> okay, thank you. So they let the audit person talks about uh, finance, yeah? <laughs> okay, all right. So uh, if I can just reconfirm, your idea is to have a campaign? Is yeah. it? Mm -hmm. yes. Okay. yes. So your main idea, innovation, is having campaign and then also calling uh, professionals Doctors coming in to help. Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay, all right, good, good. Because next week, like I said, we are going to base on your ideas, yeah? To do review. Okay, thank you, group number one. Now, can we go to group number two? Group number two, who are you guys? Group two? Cairo. Do you remember? Cairo, mm. yes, Cairo. Who Faiz. else? Faiz. Are you and? Are you and? Who's the other one? Are you? Sharina. And Sharina. Okay, all right. So, three minutes for a view, yeah? Okay. Okay, yes, ready? Yes said and like i said try to use when you're talking try to use these phrases okay ready go no yes now <laughs> oh i need to do okay we uh, we Can acknowledge the we acknowledge the the symptom of the mental illness where the proper statement of our employee is mm -hmm. the anxiety. We managed to conclude that we are proposing that one idea is the working engagement among the top level management and the co-worker, the low management. This can help to emphasize the anxiety where the model that we are using will be Google and Google platform and Zoom platform. Okay, next, proceed to support my friends okay. for the okay. advantage and disadvantage. Okay, it's fine. Okay, so the advantages for advantages for working engagement is I would like to emphasize that uh, we can share an ideas when we are communicating each other. For example, we can talk about more than uh, other than about the COVID-19 because we are bored, uh, we are boring about COVID-19, right? So we, uh, we are bored about COVID-19. So we can talk about the latest issue right now. We have the Euro, European, uh, the Euro Cup, the Euro and also the Copa America. And also we can talk about the sports 
especially we talk about sport each other when we are working engagement. So it can uh, make a fun and happily to other people when we are communicate each other. So I would like to pass the advantages and disadvantages to my friend, okay. my okay. partner. Hi, uh, I will talk about disadvantages. Mm -hmm. uh, for me, engagement between top level and staff uh, via online platform, I think not everyone will give full cooperation. Not everyone have the same interest. For example, if we want to talk about sport, not everyone into sport. And uh, some more, uh, people, uh, when, when, you, when you do one-to-one -one session, people will know your problem, but not all understand. Hmm. Okay, so... You're talking about disadvantages, right, Sharina? Yeah, yes, disadvantages. Okay. Uh, some more. Uh, uh, I want to talk about advantages. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, um, during COVID, during COVID, one one of the factor that cause anxiety or mental health is the staff feel unsecure about their job. Are they might lose their job? Uh, so I think maybe the management or uh, top level can give them some support, can give them some uh, some promise uh, to to make them feel more secure. Uh, uh, and uh, I think uh, I, I, pass, I pass. I pass. I pass. I pass to yeah. Ayu next. Okay, you. All right, you. Okay, for the next point, I'm going to talk about the online platform, the disadvantages, mm -hmm. the online platform. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. The one that I would like to highlight is we are we are getting a less communication with the the uh, the top management between the top management and the coworker less communication. Mm -hmm. And number two is it is hard to understand because we are in the online meeting and sometimes we are misunderstanding and we miss the point that he or she want to express. And number three, not 100% committed. Because uh, uh, as, you, uh, as you know, when we are doing the online in online platform, uh, there's always something that disturbing you. And sometimes you cannot focus and cannot give uh, the commitment 100% on the work that you're discussing. Mm, that's all for me. Okay, all right, thank you. Group number two. So, um, based on my understanding, you are proposing a working engagement between top level and bottom level, right? Yes, yes. yes. Through, through online platform, is it? Yes. Yes, okay. So number one, we've got a campaign. Group number two is working engagement through between top and bottom through online platform. Let's listen to the last group, which is group number three. Okay, group number three, take away. Whenever you're ready. Yes, I'm ready. Okay, Kat. Yes. Okay, Kat. Uh, uh, start, right? Okay. Uh, yes. From our short discussion just now, mm -hmm. the innovation that we want to highlight for our management is to have the online Zoom Zoom the online Zoom, Zumba and mm -hmm. uh, road run, five mm -hmm. kilometer competition. Uh, wow, okay. I want to address that. I want to address uh, <laughs> that with, with this activity, it will reduce the mental and health problem. Uh, for example, like a Zumba, maybe we can do it uh, weekly, which is every Wednesday through online. Uh, HR may, may hire uh, one Zen to conduct the Zumba. While for the road run competition, uh, we would like to propose uh, uh, doing it by uh, monthly, uh, where uh, for each of staff, maybe they will take a time uh, running about five kilometers and submit the time to HR. Okay, from the discussion, uh, we, find, we found that uh, there is an X factor and setback of this proposal. So for the X factor, maybe uh, Siti Haja and um, Shahira will continue. Okay, uh, we had highlighted two advantages of organizing Zumba and Road Run uh, online. 
So firstly, by uh, attending a Zumba, we'll avoid employee feel lonely uh, because uh, while uh, accomplish their tasks. Through Zumba, uh, employee able to interact with other uh, co-workers. So secondly, um, by joining Zumba, Zumba is a healthy activity. It will avoid employee fall sick. Uh, during uh, uh, during uh, this pandemic. Okay, next. Uh, for, another, uh, for another advantage, um, as we know, uh, during the pandemic, um, people uh, people, uh, people always give a complaint about um, their body weight. Uh, uh, they 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 gain their body weight. And so, uh, if you if we if we do uh, this activity, uh, maybe they can reduce their weight, uh, and they can become the healthy person during the pandemic. Uh, okay, uh, next, uh, I will pass to uh, uh, Kas, uh, for the uh, this advantage of this uh, activity. Uh, first of all, I would like to highlight that doing doing the Zumba and comp fun run competition, it has also the disadvantages. The disadvantages, not every staff have a quality connection. Uh, maybe other staff have poor connection. Okay, however, not everybody can join the the session or the competition Zoom and Zumba session. Uh, our group has already calculated that the, prob the probability uh, to staff join, probability uh, about staff to join the competition may be in 50%. Okay, that's all from me. Thank you. 50% is not Thank bad, right? <laughs> okay. All right. So, based on all the innovation, we've got campaigns. We've got, uh, what do you call it? We've got online Zumba and virtual run, as well as working engagement from bottom and top. Honestly speaking, if you were in the shoes, which one would you be most attracted to and why? Anybody? What did you say? Uh, I don't know. Mm. Sorry, tadi tepu tepu. Uh -huh. Yes. Tepu tepu. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, the line is breaking. Yeah, I think it's my connection. Okay, I'm going to repeat. Yeah, if you were in um these employees' shoes, and you get to choose which innovation you could go to to improve your mental health, which would you choose between the three and why? Between campaign, working level engagement, or online Zumba and virtual right? Which one would you choose? I will choose engagement. 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 Yeah. Mm -hmm. Top to bottom, okay. What about the rest? Uh, for me, I want to. I also Zumba vote for engagement. But you also vote for engagement. Wow, wow, amazing. Why? Why would you like such engagement? Sometimes uh, we need to talk to someone, hmm. but not related with our family. But you want to talk with people in your work at your workplace. Yeah, sometimes we need to share something, our sad or happiness with someone. I see. Okay, okay. Anyone else would choose something besides working engagement? Cause you said you would go with Zumba. Uh, actually, I like to. I choose the uh campaign because campaign. of uh, the campaign because of uh one of the factor that we will engage the the psychology doctor. So I think it's better lah because of their more experience um, uh, to, to solve uh, the mental problem. Yes. You know, I'm not going to tell you yet or reveal which I think I would choose if I were in the shoes. We'll leave that to next week. Okay, next week we are going to learn about reviewing. You know, always when you're working, especially if you're working in advertising or marketing. Or me, me, me. Yeah, Shalina. Oh, you're working in marketing and advertising, yeah? At TV3. Wow, really? Oh. Like, which, do you have like a specific... Uh, I'm working at TV3. 
TV3. So do you work with all the programs on TV3 or certain? Certain. Certain, certain one. Which so are, every, every day is a pitching session. Uh, yeah, so you know, you can always be presented with products, right? Yeah. You always have to choose, can We have to review and give feedback, can uh, Yeah. Yeah, so this I think happens. So, so uh, my English very bad, so it's difficult <laughs> for me to. <laughs> Hopefully, inshallah, you know, with with the help of this class and your classmates, you will be able to improve slowly. No inshallah. problem. Inshallah. inshallah. You are getting better, right? Yeah, you know, with all presented, for example, at least now you can use something else besides say and mention, you know? Yeah. So all this, yeah, because we are always, especially once we're working, even when you are, those of you who are still studying, like Ayu, Kas, uh, Faiz, Anis, and Haja, are you working, Haja? Or Shahira, I'm not sure. Those of you who are still working, you would always be required to do a review. If it's not literature review, some sort of review. Cairo, you're also doing your master's kind. So reviewing is an important part in language, in English language proficiency. So next week, based on all your ideas, Ni, we are going to do a review and we are going to collectively, as a group, choose the best idea. Okay, all right? Okay. Okay, so any questions up before we end tonight? Oh, tonight we were on time. Good job. We're on time tonight, I think. 10, 15, huh? Do you have any questions so far? So today we've looked at um, different ways of saying, say and mention in a meeting or while pitching an idea. We've also looked at different phrases to use when you are describing pros and cons or advantages and disadvantages. Again, Sharina, this would be very helpful for you. Yeah. I'm going to be sharing the, uh, what do you call it? The slide, yeah, don't worry. I'll be sharing the slide on uh, into our WhatsApp group. And we've also looked at the conversation between Noelia and Yuna just now. So when you're you're in a what do you call it? When you are in a conversation with your colleague, so that's how you have a healthy conversation, even if you don't agree with each other. Okay. Do you have any questions so far for tonight? No, no teacher. No, yeah. Okay. So I'll see you no, next teacher. week, inshallah. All right. Um. Okay. Uh. I. Uh. Teacher. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, uh, our yes, sorry, sorry. our you did for the assignment. Ah, thank you for reminding me. Actually, tomorrow. What assignment? Tomorrow. What assignment? Oh my God! Don't do that, Faiz. You don't do that. What assignment? Yeah, I'm going to remind you again. So, okay, I know you guys are busy, so I'm going to let you until what's the date today? Okay, I'm going to give you until the end of the month. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, because, have another one week. Yeah, because what you know, assignment, I, teacher? Uh, okay, Anis and Sharina, I'll be sharing with you okay. what assignment you need to do. It's a video assignment of you speaking. Oh, okay. So, so every now and then, because for you to be able to practice whatever we've learned, one of the ways is uh, you listening to yourself doing a video okay. or whatsoever. I'm not going to give it every week because I know you guys are busy. So last week, we've got one assignment for the month, which you will submit and uh, at the end of the month. Okay? Because okay. even I I actually intended to do one video to show you guys as an example. But I would not so busy, kan? So I, I'm going to, inshallah, come up with my video so I can give you guys an example of how to do it. So, uh, so, so means, uh, any, uh, any video? Have, it can be any video based on, remember the question, Tap? Yes. The question from last week, kan? Yeah. If you, or, uh, if you could turn back in time or if you could go to the future using future. the second and third conditional. So, which one would you choose? Oh, so. Yeah. So, just uh, uh, make a video about that. So, we have to that. take yeah, the video, yeah. right? Yes, you have to take the video. You have to record yourself. And then download to the... Okay. And then download to the... Uh, before. Uh, you can right. share with me. Either if you've uh -huh. got... Let's say you want to share onto your social media platform. You can share. And then give me the link. If you've got YouTube, you want to upload onto YouTube pun boleh. Then give me the link. Or if you do... You prefer not to put on social media. You can just telegram me the uh, videos. Okay. So, but WhatsApp susah kan? WhatsApp, you cannot, it cannot exceed more than one minute. 
So mm. you can telegram. Uh, so know. the video is around two minutes, is it? Ah, uh, two minutes. Did yes. I say two minutes? Yes, two minutes. Two, yes, yes. Two to three minutes. Yeah, two minutes two is minutes. enough. Ah, uh, two minutes. You want to do it on TikTok? TikTok maximum is two minutes, kan? Ah, boleh lah. Ah, uh, Miss, <laughs> if I'm not mistaken, <laughs> yeah. don't know how to use TikTok. <laughs> Tahu yeah, tak apa, account semua tak ada What is it Salisa? Tak ada account The uh -huh. the title for the assignment is If I if he cool um, could meet hmm? uh, and, and, and Ancestor Ah betul and, and Not not uh, what you say uh, Past and future right Ah Betul dia because if you want to Where to go back in time and meet your ancestors You uh. go to the past lah kan Betul tak? Um, so if you if you had choose uh, chosen you want to go back to the past you would be using third conditional means anything about past and future is it uh, anything about past and future kalau oh, you go to the past uh, why would you rather go to the past tapi idea itu meeting your ancestors kan Ah yes, ah, meeting the so you, so, uh -uh. so the, the uh, uh, is quite difficult lah because I don't you know idea no, okay if let's say you don't want you want to miss you want to take out the ancestors uh -huh. we not focus yeah. on going yeah, back to the uh, yeah passenger. i think better it's a request ah okay boleh tak apa as long cause because i want you to speak uh, it's okay because we try to to uh, review the, that title so uh -huh. i think it's quite difficult to find the 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 items lah it's better if we can change uh Understand, understand. Means we can think something or can imagine something. Uh, is not fixed lah, fixed item. Yeah, I think maybe because kalau the word ancestors, uh, ancestors and great, uh, what? Great, uh, great, 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 I choose either one as long as you speak. The idea okay, okay. is you need to speak. Okay. okay. Right, right. And the question. End of the month. Banyak masa lagi ni. Boleh? Teacher. Allah, yeah. Yes, Anis. How, how about me? Okay, Anis and Sharina, I will be resharing the homework. Okay. Yes. And also the notes on second and third conditional so that you can refer to the notes and do the video as well. All right. Okay, is this a simple video? Don't uh, don't be too nervous about making grammatical mistakes and things like that. It's okay, All right? Okay, teacher. Okay. okay. Any so other questions? Uh, end of the month, right? Send uh, end of the month. So you've got like how many more days? About one week plus, a bit more. One week plus. Ah, uh, one week plus lagi. Okay, teacher. Okay, I put that some part about video to so tak apa tak apa faham. Okay, yeah. So, can we call it a night, everybody? Okay. Yes, me. Okay. All right. So, have a good week, everyone. Stay safe. And I'll see you next week, inshallah. I'll be, as usual, sharing the video and notes by tomorrow, yeah? Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Miss. Bye. 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 Assalamualaikum. Waalaikumsalam. Bye-bye. 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 Bye-bye.